Tonight is Halloween, we know that, and we wanted to know where the best haunted places across the Central Coast were. Our KION's Melody Waintall took us on a spooky trip to show us some paranormal activity across our area. Take a look. There were haunted places that appeared on the show Ghost Adventures, like the Steinbeck House in Salinas, or the Robinson Jeffers Tour House in Carmel by the Sea. The Carmel Doll Shop was also on the show when the owners moved to Pacific Grove to the 1902 Ingwin Building, only to find out it's supposedly haunted. At night, I hear it creaking, uh -huh. so it's always at early mornings, at like 3 in the morning. A neighbor who appeared on the show has been living in the building next door for over three years when Ghost Adventures team it was came. so weird. They told him that someone who was helping the owners died one night, and they think his soul still roams the building. I don't think anyone's staying there at the night, but it's, I always hear stuff when there's like the hours are supposed to be closed, so that's what's kind of creepy about it. Further north in Watsonville is the Toodle Mansion, better known for a series of tragic events, including a murder, a suicide, and an accident where the person died in the mansion. Our store is the actual carriage house to the mansion, and, um, it's, both of them are haunted. Don and Kelly are the owners of the antique store right next to the Toodle Mansion. And they mentioned the porch lights that flicker. And, and a, a lot of times the spirits will attach themselves to something and go home with somebody. Um, because we've had people tell us that things have happened at their house oh. since they bought the item from our store. The house was built in 1999 by William H. Weeks like he did in Watsonville houses. It was sold to the Toodles for $5,000 at the time and had acres and acres of apple orchards. Now rooms are rented out as office spaces. Uh, of course there's been tons of other stuff but you know eventually we hope that we can do something where where people can visit. Do you know any scary stories here on the Central Coast? In Watsonville. I'm Melody Wayne with KION News Channel 46. All right, pretty spooky stuff right there, Melody. Thank you for that. Well, we got a lot to talk about.